the Pleiadian High Council channel through West Amac March 23, 2012. Your power held within of expressing itself in marvelous ways. The illusion is cropping up all around many of you in your times of great distress, and the illusory constraints that you have placed over yourselves for so long are making their final stands while attempting to convince you that you do not possess or hold the higher dimensional abilities that are prevalent in the spirit complexes of each and every soul incarnate on earth at this time. It is important now for us to stress the importance of your making an effort to feel only feelings of the highest and purest expressions of the joy and love that you are growing toward each and every moment of your experience. Indeed, one cannot find the energies of love while they are themselves stressed and continuously letting in and feeding the lower energies of illusory limitation that are again making their final stance. We watch over you in your daily efforts and endeavors, and we wish dearly that you beautiful souls of Earth could realize the assistance you are being given from across the veil. You are being pushed to choose the energies of love over the energies that you have grown used to and that are consistently reproduced in your spirit complexes upon your feeling of such things. The importance of you doing so has never been stronger than it is now, as the realized power that you hold within yourselves is growing exponentially in purity every day and indeed every moment of your existence. The power that you hold within is now beginning to express itself in marvelous ways and in ways that will be getting your attention. Have you been feeling the numerous shifts from numerous states of consciousness that you have been undergoing throughout your days? These shifts are constantly and continually occurring and the reason you are feeling such shifts in easier ways now is because you are coming back to the remembrance of your divine selves, and this is happening in accordance with the growth that humanity as a collective is undergoing along with the ascending surface of dear Gaia. We can feel your depleted energy levels and your unwillingness to perform many daily duties and responsibilities. But just know, dear souls, that upon our arrival and upon the more noticeable changes to your bodies and spirits in your ascension processes, you will feel nothing but unlimited energy and you will be doing so very many things to assist in bringing the new surface earth to full form. Yes. We know that you are tired now but we implore you to keep on in your daily efforts for you are all deciding what manifests on the surface of earth through the emotions you choose to let come through you and through the decisions you make in each and every moment. You are all going to be needed quite crucially in the immediate period ahead. As again there is so very much work to be done and this work will start with the informing of humanity of the existence of the Illuminati and all that they have done to you over the centuries. Of course you have heard that this is going to happen so very many times and many of you feel that you are used to such predictions and will be able to handle the resulting revelations then they do come to the fore. But dear souls, we wish you to know that indeed, even those of you who are most ready for these revelations to occur will be quite surprised and at times very overwhelmed with all of the information you are being given. Even the longest channelings which contain much information about what has been done to your world as well as about the ascension process you are undergoing will not have even come close to scratching the surface in relation to all that you will be let know. The immediate period ahead will indeed be busy and demanding.
but you will be provided with all of the energy you will need and then some when the most potent work on earth begins to be performed to heal her not by us, by by you. Upon the disclosure announcements and after the adjustment period that humanity will be given, you will of course see the decreed arrival of our starships and motherships as well as the arrival of many ascended masters on the beams of light that they so enjoy traveling throughout creation on. The beams of light that we speak of are higher dimensional etheric energies that surpass the purity of energies expressed and manifested in the third and fourth dimensions. This is how your ascended masters and etheric guides prefer to travel, as they have evolutionarily surpassed the need or even the want to travel in and inhabit our starships and motherships. This of course does not mean that they still do not accompany us on our starship and motherships, as indeed they do for there are many meetings that take place on a moment-to-moment -moment basis in relation to events occurring on Earth, on other planets and in other galaxies. You will see our motherships and starships in their full beauty and upon the adjustment that humanity must undergo after witnessing us in the physical so to speak, we will begin maturing and showing off of our craft as well as many other higher dimensional technologies that until now, you have only heard of and such technologies have been assumed to be figments of the imagination of your science fiction genre. To those who are ready, when the time is right after our official arrival we will begin training you as to how to use and cooperate with our craft and with the craft that will become readily available to the majority of humanity. We anticipate many souls being quite excited about trying out our craft and flying around in the beautiful sky of Gaia and your consciousness levels will have increased substantially in purity by that time to ensure that you will be able to handle flying in our craft and indeed taking in our ascended forms in our full purity and in our full awesomeness. Your consciousness levels are currently quite dense compared to the purity of consciousness you will be experiencing upon the arrival of us as well as the arrival of the many synchronistic dates along your cosmic calendar that have yet to be reached but that will see glorious leaps and bounds in the individual and collective consciousness of humanity once such dates are reached and passed. We can feel that your concept of time is indeed fading ever efficiently, and this is because your bodies and souls are vibrating at a quicker and sure pace that sees the reality which you move around and also begin to vibrate at such faster paces. It must be understood how you actually navigate through your reality and how you actually navigate through your concept of time for it to be understood exactly how your reality is speeding up in accordance with your ascension processes. Of course, such things will be explained to you in ways that are so very clear and easy to understand on your part and again the consciousness and intelligence levels of so many of you will have increased substantially by the times we speak of and this will see you better able to absorb the many truths and wonders that we have to share with you. Again, we know that your journeys on earth have been difficult and we can feel in our own ways the densities that you are feeling even right now and we wish you to know that despite what you are going through, you are being lead to a wondrous future and the manifestation of this future is in progress at this very moment. You are all extremely crucial in the manifestation of this future, which is why we made so very many pleas for you to let only pure and wonderful feeling energies and emotions through yourselves as feeling lower emotions will serve to block your chakras and halt the energy coming through them. 
while attempting to